Good day, my friend. In this occasion, I would like to demonstrate how to boost your security while you're working online by uh, one incredible um, extension. You can either find it in uh, Google Chrome or uh, Mozilla Firefox. It's just released a couple uh, weeks ago. And if you know, the, um, the name is uh, Privacy Badger. If you look at the web, you can if you want to know more about these uh, apps, you can go to www.eff.org. So the name of the application is Privacy Badger. But in this case, I would like uh, to demonstrate how to download this uh, using Google Chrome. So uh, first of all, you just need to open your Google uh, page and then go to the uh, top right corner you will have three dots there if you click on that you will have one dialog box and then please go to more tool until you find another dialog box just follow the extension and click that you will have another page open for uh, this page called extension but you want to scroll it down until you have uh, one link it's called get more extension link if you want to click on that and then you will have another uh, page open for you that is a Chrome Web Store but you want to go to the this search bar you just need to click um, privacy and type it privacy badger and then hit enter on the top of your list you will have um, the exact name of that app so it's called privacy badger if you want to click on that you can also read a lot of um, overview uh, of how to use this uh, particular uh, extension but i will show you in a minute in short and also you can read a lot of review what people think about this people opinions and also support and you can also relate it there but um if you want to uh, download and install this you just need to go to the top uh, right corner you will have like add to chrome green button but in this case i did in my case because i have installed that so i want you to go on to add to chrome and then click that green button until it's uh it will automatically install uh, into your browser when it, it install if you uh, look and uh, observe my skin uh, my screen uh, we'll have like little dot here it's called privacy badger dot is the symbol of fox i guess or something if you click on that you will have that list uh, of uh, privacy badger now we'll show you in a minute how how to use this privacy badger how um, this privacy badger will increase your security so first of all you just need to open your uh, uh, like uh, your daily website that you often go to that website for example here i have the new york time when i open this new york time like it or not there will be a company and also organization will uh, put some cookies to track your webs so to uh, uh, either the tracking activity for positive sign or for negative sign but they want they, they will put some cookies and also some tracking machine into your into your uh, your browser so they can know who you are and what you uh, want or what you try to find out and also etc that is uh, something so that will make our privacy um, uh, abuse so uh, if you uh, observe on my screen now on this privacy badger icon you will have a lot of number there when you want to click on that okay you will have a lot of this is the privacy badger detected 31st potential trackers they put trackers and cookies on this page uh, so while you open this new york times there will be 31 potential tracker that will uh, put on you uh, on your page and they will uh, try to know what uh, what activity you want to do in this uh, uh, new york time page so if you want to scroll down you will have all the 31 potential trackers with different color what does it mean so uh, now i want you to go to the top of the privacy badgers page you will have option this is the gear symbol if you click on that gear symbol you will have uh, X, uh, a bigger page 
so in this in this case you will have like a lot of uh, option here the first is general uh, settings and also you will have whitelist domains you will have tracking domains and then uh, manage data also so in in tracking domains you will have you shouldn't need to modify anything here the first time you click my icon blah, 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 blah. and in general setting you will have uh, some something like this so uh, uh, you have a whitelist domain so uh, for example if you want to whitelist some domains you can always click here and type your domain and then add domain is will um, uh, anytime you open that domain is will uh, either even though the domain have a tracker machine it will whitelist by this uh, privacy uh, badger so uh, in this option you can have a lot of uh, in this menu you can have a lot of option to manage your uh, cookies now let's go back to this new york time yeah, uh, I will uh, uh, explain a little bit what is the difference between uh, between uh, the colors here. For example, if you have like green color, it means that um, uh, this privacy page will allow this this specific website to to uh, to track you. But if you recognize the website is uh, uh, so uh, dangerous, and you you know that website, you can move the the button to this uh, uh, this uh, yellow color so in yellow it will block the cookies here and you can also have a, a, a option to uh, scroll the yellow color to this uh, red button so if the color of the button turn red it means that you uh, fully block uh, this this uh, specific website and then also you have a cbing.com here is a low here but if you not happy with that you can always block that specific website and drag it to uh, red color and also if you want to scroll down until you find out this this 31 potential tracker you can scroll it down and for example in facebook um, so the privacy badger by default uh, will uh, block the cookies but if you want to totally block facebook go ahead and scroll it to red and now um is a uh, facebook is blocked uh, in your uh, uh, during your visiting this, uh, new york time and also uh, you have a lot of option to apply on on this uh, potential uh, trackers so scroll it down all the way until underneath and go ahead and and read that uh, domain uh, specific domain name and go ahead either you want to uh, block the cookies or just uh, totally block the website okay what's about the others uh, here in in this new york time we have a 12 potential tracker and if you visit something else for example here i have uh, huffingtonspost.com also you will have more here trackers so if for example here if you want to click so you have 75 potential trackers in this specific website so this is something and this is uh, a lot also so uh, it tell us that whenever we we, we uh, visit any specific website it's always tracker machine uh will following us and spy on us looking what activity we, we do here and also uh, track our machine and give the special specific uh, specific uh ads for us so go ahead and read scroll down this list and also if you want to uh like increase the security always change the green button to either yellow or a red button if it is already turned red then it's safe it means that that specific uh, uh, side is blocked already fully blocked and if it, it is it's still uh, green you have to either choose you want to uh, left it green okay you have three choices actually stay green it means that you allow 
the specific website to, uh, to track you with one or different reason of course and then if you turn it uh, yellow the same you want to um, block the cookies of of this specific website and if you turn it red you totally want to block this website from tracking you do the same for the others also now i will show you uh, the others where for example uh, i have like this yahoo local yahoo if you know here i have like nine potential trackers so a lot also and i can go around and read my list and also decide either i want to keep this uh, specific trackers to be uh, green go ahead and if i, if I think that I, sh I should block this i think i can uh, change to yellow or if i totally want to block it i just need to change it to red it will uh will be um a totally block it and also if uh, we go to like uh, this guardian i i also find uh this uh privacy badger find 18 potential trackers here but uh, it, uh on the number it's all only put nine why because uh, the other nine is already red and already blocked by default because uh, this uh, privacy badger recognize this specific uh this specific uh, web is a, uh, is a dangerous tracker. Uh, for example, this Facebook, I have turned it red. So when, uh, when whenever I open the other uh, website, for example, I open this Jakarta Post, uh, if if um, Facebook still there, is, uh, Facebook will be red. So uh, now, during accessing any website in this browser, in this Chrome, Facebook always block by this privacy badge by default because I already said it uh, just like that. And also another uh, web here, for example, um, if you want to turn this this uh, green YouTube here uh, to block the cookies of YouTube, go ahead and block at that. But if you want to block all the YouTube, just scroll it uh, to the red, and then now YouTube will be banned uh, from your activity in uh, in Chrome. So, guys, if you want to have you want to have like a full security and also full privacy in accessing any page in your Chrome, I really recommend you to install this incredible privacy badger and. Uh, uh, click the icon, learn your list, and whenever you think that uh, that specific uh, trackers should be blocked, go ahead and turn the button into either uh, uh, yellow or, or red if you want totally to uh, block that specific website. Okay, I think that's it. I really recommend you to download and install this uh, wonderful uh, security and then uh, enjoy your activity online. So thank you for today. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.